You're growing facial hair because your estrogen receptors are broken. What's up guys? It's your PCOS specialist, Cash Arroyo, aka That Girl with PCOS. And we're going to talk about why you have facial hair or receding hairline, cystic acne, balding. We're going to get into all of that. Having a broken estrogen receptor comes from having a bad gut, bad diet, insulin resistance, or even having nutrient deficiencies. What happens is your body needs estrogen in certain parts, right? Even your brain. So your brain starts to send a signal out like, hey, we need more estrogen here, here, and here. But first, it needs to send out testosterone, right? So if it sends out testosterone and your estrogen receptor is broken, it doesn't know. It keeps sending more testosterone, more testosterone, because testosterone has to go through a phase called aromatization, which turns into estrogen. So think of it as testosterone does a little dance and then it turns into estrogen. But the problem is if your estrogen receptor is broken, your brain keeps signaling, oh, we need more estrogen, sending more testosterone and more and more and more. It can't turn into estrogen because your estrogen receptor is broken. So what does that mean? That means that when your body is filled with testosterone, you start to see male-like patterns of baldness, hair thinning, hair receding. Okay, we don't want that. Um, cystic acne and even facial hair, AKA hirsutism. Oh, honey. If you feel like you are starting to see this in your journey with PCOS, it may be time to start to look inward to see what it is that we need to fix so that we don't have these problems anymore. I hope that that kind of helped you out. And if it didn't, or you have more questions, let me know in the comments and I'll be here to answer them. Love you, Pookie.